Who do we get to the Hello, Yarnabees! Today is another episode of 25 Days of Blissmas that I am doing with Rosalie at Yarn It Out. <sighs> How you doing? I'm doing okay. Well, today might be a painkiller day. Uh, it snowed a little bit again yesterday and I woke up and it was gone. Again, it's not staying. I'm not sure how I feel about that. <laughs> Um, I'm glad it's not snowing because then I can go out and drive whatever I want. But, you know, it's Christmas. Just saying. <laughs> anyway, chai tea today. Yay! Mm. Oh, yeah. I put a little extra um, clove in it. Mmm. I don't know why I'm on this chai tea kick lately. What the heck? I don't know. It's weird. It's like, does my, is there something in it that my body's craving or? Like, I don't know. It's weird. Mm. Oh. Okay. Shall we? A skate. Isn't that cute? Oop. No, we don't need you. Isn't that cute? <laughs> it's got the little snowflakes. And this is like, this is actually cloth. Like it's, it looks like cork. <laughs> That's cute. Oh, minus that. That's really cute. You know, you could probably crochet something like that. Hmm. <laughs> Not me, because, you know, me and Amigurumi. I don't know. So there you go. We've got another one to add to the tree. Okay. Let's see what our question was. I had something I wanted to talk to you guys about. I can't for the life of me remember what it was. It's probably because I'm not quite awake yet, but. Okay. Yesterday's question was, what figure from English folklore came to be associated with Santa Claus? It was Father Christmas. A lot of people put St. Nick. And uh, there's some, what was the other ones? A lot got Father Christmas too. <laughs> So, yay! Oh, no. <laughs> okay, the next question is... The Muppets Christmas Carol. <laughs> you remember that? <laughs> oh. Who played Scrooge? Hint, he wasn't a Muppet. <laughs> In Muppets Christmas Carol, who played Scrooge? He wasn't a Muppet. Oh, wow. You know, what was it? I just saw, I saw something that was a Muppet themed. Oh, um, on TikTok, <laughs> there's a guy there that has an Elmo doll or an Elmo pu um, puppet. And he's the, El, that Elmo is the most vulgar little thing. It, it's actually kind of funny. You know, he sounds exactly like Elmo though. Like he's got the voice down. Oh, is George home? Yeah, he's got the voice down. Like it's, it's insane. But he's a vulgar, nasty little 
<laughs> so I'm not sure if you go on TikTok and you look up Elmo if it comes up, but oh, he's funny. He's actually really funny. <laughs> he's, he's got like a couple roommates and, you know, it's like, oh, just smack talk. <laughs> anyway um so my sweater i'm uh, about to start the um other side and then i'm going to start filming and, and then i got to do the sleeves and then i'm finished that so that is going to be a tutorial for what you're gonna have to find out <laughs> and when is it coming out you'll have to wait and find out <laughs> so um yeah so anyways i i'm so excited about these couple of things that i've got in the works it's kind of all part of that revamping my channel thing so um yeah i'm totally pumped i'm sorry i can't tell you about it yet because i haven't got all the deets down <laughs> So yeah, but what I can tell you is that it's one of them is going to be with Jeanette at Hoot, uh, Miss Hootie Hootenin, and the other is possibly going to be with Heather the Crochet Witch. Yeah, so stay tuned for that. Um, the gift opening with Billy the Crafty Floridian is coming up soon. So excited for that um what else what else what else what else i don't know what else you know i had a, a ups was it ups or fedex or anyways i had a delivery driver drop off a, a package yesterday at our side door and i always say the front door and he put it on the top step and the top step is the one step that doesn't have an awning on it. It got soaked last night because it was like a, a wet snow. Oh, 2.30 in the morning, I'm like looking at my phone and I realized I got a message saying your package was delivered. And I go out there and the box is just a mushy mess. And I thought, oh, it, there's a good, it's a good thing there wasn't any yarn in that. I was so mad. Oh, you know, get it together, people. Like, God, delivery drivers should have some common sense. You know, I know when I'm delivering food, the one thing that really irks me is when you get food delivered and they put it right in front of your door. So if you've got a screen door, you can't open the door because the food's right there. Is seriously, look and see if they've got a door that opens outward, then put it beside the door, not in front of the door. Does that not make sense? You know, the last thing you need is to open the door, knock your bag over, and if you've got soup or something in it, it's like toast. It's it's like all over the place. Oh. People just don't have common sense. Where did that rant come from? <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. <laughs> so anyways, I'm going to go. And uh, thanks for joining me. Don't forget to go check out Rosalie's channel to see what I got her. And yeah. Um, that's it. <laughs> I don't know subscribe like do all the things I'm <laughs> okay guys i'm gonna go i will talk to you later bye